Welcome to Comedy's Coolia Cell. Today I'm going to tell you three things to know before you read Oedipus. Let's get started. The first thing you need to know about Oedipus is the theme. The theme of Oedipus is the question, do we have the power to do what we want? Or is there something called fate? Is there something telling us we have to do something? We don't have control of our lives. Someone has control of us or something has control of us. Does God or do gods control our lives and tell us what to do? That is the theme in Oedipus. Let's go on to the next part. The second thing you need to know before you read Oedipus is, uh, well, are the characters. The two main characters to know are Oedipus and Jocasta, and I'm really bad at these names. Uh, Oedipus is the king of Thebes in this story. Thebes is a city in ancient Greece. Jocasta is the queen of Thebes, and she doesn't believe in this fate thing. She thinks you can do whatever you want, uh, and she had proof. She said, oh, I'm right, because Someone told us that I would marry my son and my husband would be killed. And that didn't happen. The husband was killed, but I didn't marry my son. We killed our son. Ha ha. So, Oedipus though is the king and that brings us to the third part. The third thing you need to know is the problem in the story. There's a curse in Thebes. Bad things are happening to this city. And the king wants to fix it. He's told he needs to find the person that killed the old king, Laos, Jocasta's first husband. And in this story, he goes on in a quest to find who the killer was. And this brings us to that first question again of, do we have control of ourselves or does someone have control of us? As you read Oedipus, you decide. Thanks for watching Conley's Cooly SL. Check out more videos of things to know before you read. Bye-bye.